So, this has been a while since I've recorded another weapon video, but uh, I've been working on... It's not so much a new weapon as a new projectile. Um, depending on how I can get it to work and everything like that, uh, I might see it incorporated into the game. Probably will, just at least for testing. But anyhow, I'll explain what's going on here after I fire a few shots and... So as you can see here, the the grenade is uh, it's not simply just bouncing. Um, it's actually uh, it's got s spin applied to it effectively. Um, you can think of it as forward or back spin on it. In this case, it's currently forward spin, and I've been messing around with the idea just to see what you can do with it. And one of the weird things is you can do stuff like that. Um, very odd behavior um I, like that that was something i just discovered actually just right now i was like ah, that's actually pretty cool um so this is a weapon that i have been just messing around with for base play really because if you can for instance if you can get this thing to go up into corners and shit like that it'll uh go where you're aiming like let's say for instance you see it exploded over there it almost is kind of a homing thing at the moment um, I plan to mess around with it to where as it bounces the uh, the spin direction on it kind of bounce like reflects off the surface as well uh, it's not quite implemented yet but the whole purpose of the weapon is to it's just really exploring the idea of applying a spin um, kind of extending the idea of bounces being more than just a simple bounce you'll see in this case the way it starts off very slow and each successive bounce it actually it builds speed with it um, and if I set the spin to negative you can see it climbs back up. And the interesting thing about negative spin is it, uh, in the case of when you're moving, you can make these very odd kind of parabolic shots. Uh, the most easily demonstrated by you get moving at a really good clip and you notice how it curves back towards you. Uh, and that's why I'm actually exploring both forward and backspin on this setup. Um, just because it's very almost trippy what you can do with it. And this almost honestly seems like a weapon to get chasers with, thinking about it. Whoa, that's actually the first time I've done that either. As, as it as you can see here, I'm pretty much just playing around with this idea. It's very... I love coding things that I've just never seen or played around with in a weapon. Or game, rather. Not weapon. Um, just because they're so... Just kind of fun to play around with with the brain. It's almost like playing with a new puzzle or something. Um, but pretty much at the moment, as you can see, it, it is just a grenade that's been modified, and that's effectively what it is. Uh, Herc, but it's been modified. It's a very cool effect, so I'm digging it a lot. If you do too, uh, or if you have any questions or comments, of course, you can drop it on the YouTube comments page or on the game forums. As I said, this is just something I'm messing around with. I just wanted to share it with everyone because it's such an interesting idea <laughs> I keep running into it so the behavior on this thing is interesting to say the least